Stephen F. Austin Middle School received a bomb threat this afternoon. Our Sunny Sai spoke with the school district and police to learn more about their cooperation to keep Brian safe. The middle school was evacuated and students and staff went to the neighboring St. Joseph's and First Presbyterian and stayed there while the police searched the building. We went into our evacuation plan, which is something that our students and our staff are trained for. Um, they, do, they do practice runs on that throughout the year. And so for most of them, it felt like a regular evacuation drill. And so they followed protocol. The building was evacuated quickly. The bomb threat did not turn out to be true, and students and staff were back at school around 1.30 in the afternoon. The Bryan School District works closely with the Bryan Police Department to ensure the safety of everyone at school. We love the relationship we have with BISD. Over the several, last several years, we've gone into uh, cooperation with them on developing plans and procedures for evacuations such as these, and it showed it went very well today. The school conducts drills and practice scenarios so that students and staff are prepared. I think it shows that all of this training that we have to go through, while it is unsettling at times, that we have to do these types of trainings, when it comes time to actually use it, even though there was no real threat today, when it came time to use it, it was just something that they had already practiced. Brian ISD staff did a great job of controlling the school, getting the students out in an organized, safe manner, and containing them while the school is being searched by the police department. Uh, the, the school does want to caution parents to not pick up their kids during an emergency situation like today. That can create an unsafe situation for both the students and the, the parents. It's important to us that we know where every student is. Um, we're keeping track of them and we're making sure they're in the safest situation possible during this. Bryan Police is asking anyone with information regarding the bomb threat to please call the police or Crime Stoppers. And Brian, I'm Sunny Sai, KAGS News. Thank you, Sunny. And an amazing display of compassion and forgiveness this afternoon in a Dallas courtroom. The brother of a murder victim hugging the former police officer convicted in his death.